Hi, in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to remove the front bumper on a 159 Brera. They are both fitted in exactly the same way with only slight styling differences between the two. Let me just show you quickly on where the bolts are located for you to remove. There is one underneath here. There is normally one on the corner down here. Three along the front bottom lip. Four along the top of the bumper. Again, there's another one this side. There's going to be another one at the bottom here normally. That's normally a Phillips screw. And then it's just clipped in mainly. So let's crack on with this and get it done. Now you do have to be careful with these because a lot of them do rust into place, so just make sure they're in completely. Uh, sometimes give it a tap with a hammer just to make sure it's fully located, uh, otherwise you will end up be rounding them off and then the only way through it is to drill them out. There are also two screws behind here that need to be undone. Okay, now all the bolts are removed from this side. The front bumper at the bottom is free. Just need to give it a little tug in this corner here, and that'll pull it out there. And then normally, and it will knock this side, will free it out. And do the same on the other side. You also need to make sure that you've undone the three bolts underneath, and then the bumper will be free. There'll be just one electrical connection on there to undo. And again, once it's free, pull out. And then push through that side. And it's out all free. And just down here is your single electrical connection which holds everything together. Okay, to refit the bumper, offer the bumper up to the front of the car, but don't fit it just yet. Place it there, plug in your electrical connection, like so, lift it up over the one block, secure that in place there, pop a bolt in there to stop it from falling off. If you refit this, it clips on at the front. Goes into there like that, and then just push that back. I'll show you once more on this side. Pop 
it in the clip up there. But I can sometimes be quite stubborn, so it may want a little bit of persuasion with the old hand there. And then just hit there, hit there, and you can see it's gone in when it all lines up. Now all you need to do is just reattach all your bolts. Don't forget to do the ones along the bottom. And make sure that the under tray, if it's on there, is also clipped in as well. Otherwise that will end up dropping down when you're driving along. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.